In this video, we will make this type of abstract scene. So let's get started. First, let's add cylinder with 6 vertices. Go to top view. Now add error modifier with count of 2 and change factor x value to 0 0.5 and for y change to 0 0.750. Now add another error modifier with count of 10 and change factor x value to 0 0.666. After this add one more error modifier with count of 4 and change y value to 0.857. After completing this process apply all modifier. Now assign this with new material. Now we need to separate these shapes from one object. So go to edit mode, select all, press P and choose by loose parts. After this set the origin to geometry. After this place the shape to center of grid like this. Now rotate on Z axis around 90 degree. Now add camera and press Alt R to reset rotation. After this increase focal length to 150 mm and change rotation X to 59 degree. Now go to camera view by pressing 0 and after this we need to change camera position from here. Now find a better angle and leave. Now select these shapes and change their position in Z axis like me. Now select one of these shapes and press shift S and select cursor to select it. Then add a sphere and make changes in position and scale. Now go to edit mode and select its top face like this. Now assign this with new emission material. After this shade smooth. Now place this sphere on the other shapes as well. Just simply snap cursor to these shapes then duplicate this sphere and snap selection to cursor like this. Now repeat this on random places. After all this add plane with emission material then change its size and position like me. Now go to render view and change EV to cycles. Let's select this shape and increase metallic value from material. Also change roughness to 0.45. After this change color to bluish. Now select this sphere and increase metallic and decrease roughness. After this go to shader editor and add object info and color ramp. Connect random to factor and color to color. Now click on plus icon two times and change their position and color. Now select all sphere and click on randomize transform. And make changes in rotation. After this change color of background to black and that's how you can achieve this type of result. You can also change plane strength value to get more bright look and you can also change exposure and gamma from here. So hope you learned something new, stay tuned, subscribe for more and see you in the next one.